Okay, so we're just about set, ready to go. Um, I'm taking my big lens today as well, because um, hopefully we should see some buzzards or some red kites as well. So, see how it goes. See you later. Okay, we've come to Barby Castle. Good views in every direction. And there's even a few birds of prey in the sky. Let's see what we can get. Okay, so we've just been tracking a red kite. Um, I got some, got my big lens on, but got some photos of it. So hopefully they come out okay. Um, oh God, it's warm today. leads the eye out between the trees out into the far distance I'm bracketing the exposure um, two stops either side um, and we'll blend that together in Lightroom hopefully it'll come out okay so uh, if it was any good here it is <laughs> shot um, overlooking Chair Hill which is right in the distance um, just happens there's a bench in front of us so people can sit and enjoy the view um, bracketing the exposure again because it's such a bright day and I'll get as much detail in this tower as possible um, manual exposure um, 7 f 7.1 and 1 500th of a second oh if it's any good here it is. Uh, stopped again on the ridgeway. Um, I found some what we think are the sarsen stones, um, the stones that were used to build a lot of Avebury and Stonehenge. Um, so there's a site just down here. Um, where they all came from, allegedly. Um, so I've managed to get them in the frame along with the Ridgeway tracks. Once the cyclists are out of the way, we can take the shot.
Okay, final descent into Avebury. Um, it's taken about three and a half hours um, from Barbary. Um, so a well deserved pint is on the way. Ah, that's better. Needed that pint. So just left the red line, got our way back to Barbary Castle. About three and a half hours, I suppose, for a walk, but the sun is out. The sky is blue, the well is lovely. Um, might, might get a sunset. Let's see what the time is. <sighs> k Not bad so far. Ah. This is our view at the moment. Not too shabby, eh? I'm getting back towards Barbary now. Been a bit of an epic walk. Um, Somewhere in the region of about 30k when we get back there. Um, hopefully when we get back, should be in time for a nice sunset. Just stop for a quick shot of the castle again. I stopped in this spot because the tree behind me is blocking my shadow, which is cast in front of the camera. Um, but the sun is also lighting up the castle really nicely. Um, bracketing exposure again. I'm at F10. Um, and if it's turned out okay, here it is. Castle a bit quicker than we thought and my legs are killing me and I just cannot be asked to stay up here for the sunset which is in about 40 minutes um, so what we're going to do is just take a quick shot um, of the sun going down over the castle and it should make for quite a nice image um, I've got f13 I've got um, a 9 uh, 0.9 ND soft grad and a 0.6 ND soft grad um, to take the sun edge off um, and I'm bracketing um, two stops and four stops either side because it's right in my face. Um, so hopefully all that there with a bracketed exposure as well, um, we should come up with some sort of nice image. Um, I wish I could stay for the sunset, but I really haven't got the energy. Um, we've just covered about 33k. Um, so uh, anyway, if this shot was any good, you'll get to see it at the end. I'll speak to you soon.